Okay, firstly, let's see something. This channel, named Quiz Monster, they make a lot of money. They hook the audience. They have really cool ideas. So, for example, there's like, guess the movie section, guess the food, guess the country. And they make a lot of money, over $10,000 per month. This channel, named Guesser, really similar ideas. Guess 50 logos, name 5 rules, guess the country, guess the food. And they make money as well. $22,000 per month according to Social Blade. And they're not that old. Have a look at this. They have been created exactly one year ago. And they get a lot of views. 5.5 million in the last 30 days. It's really cool. Why these videos work, you ask? Well, they're simple. Whatever the audience, younger generation or older ones, it's just fun. And it's not like they're super complicated, you know, they just give you some answers, some really cool tricks, and it's not unusual to see comments like these. So, people not only just like give how many of those they have guessed right, but they also just express love to these channels, like your videos so much. So, people really like them. They also compete with one another, and that is a great thing if you have a YouTube channel. So, today we're gonna see how to make these in bulk just using ChatGPT and Canva.com. Now on ChatGPT, I want you to make something like this. It's not hard. Simple prompt, you have to write like this. So give me 15 countries and a hint that represents the country in a table of three columns. Numbers on the first column, hint on the second column, and the country names on the third column. So this is what you're gonna get, like Excel sheet, which has all of these countries and their respective hints. So, for example, for vodka, it is going to be Russia. You see, really simple ideas. I mean, simple ideas get you the money. So, once you make this, head over to canva.com, switch over to videos, click on this one, which is a horizontal one for long form content, 1920 by 1080. Click on create blank. Once you get inside, I don't want you to go with the templates, I want you to go over to elements and I want you to find the background. You can simply type background, or you can just type the color. I like to use blue background. Hit the enter key, then switch over to elements, then switch over to videos section here, and then choose one of these that you like. For example, I like this one. I'm just gonna move this like this, and there's a video background for us. That's the first step. The second step, I want a frame for the countries. So here's the frames in the elements as well. Click on the frames. And then I want you to type in rectangle with a border. You can just type in rectangle and it will give you the option with a border. Now choose something that is a respective. We want to put the flag inside of there. So something like this would be nice. Or something like this, let's say. Put it like this, resize it to the size that you think it's going to be okay. Put it here on the right side. And now we just head over to this section and search for a country flag. So let's do it with pizza and Italy. Simply type in Italy or paste that. And you can even just go with the flag because sometimes it's not going to give you the flag right away. You have to switch over to photos here. And of course, it's going to give you Italy flag. Now what you want to do, drag this to the frame inside of this and right away you have the flag of first country. Move this because the second step is going to be adding a bit of a text. Click on the text, click on add a heading and now reposition here and change the text inside with the following. Simply type in guess the country. Now, you can, of course, change the fonts of this. Canva is a really good thing, and it's really easy to use. You can just click on the underline if you want it like this. Fonts are here, so you can just choose one of these fonts. I like to use Chewy one. I can just scroll down and search one of these until I find something that is really good for me. For example, this one is also good. Garamond is also good. Just go and play with it until you feel confident. Now, I want to add a bit more of this text. I'm going to add a subheading and I'm going to write hint. So that's going to be our hint. Now, when you complete this, you can just copy this with control C and then control V to paste that one. Now I need this one as well to change the text and that's going to be the hint for that country. So pizza, paste the pizza there, then just move this one like this move this underneath and you can even increase the size of this one to differentiate a bit and one more thing that we need is a circle go to elements go to circle and right away when you just type in circle it will give you the option to add a shape 
we need the shape for the number. I'm going to move this here. I'm going to resize it. I'm going to change the color because I don't like this one. It's really easy. Just change the color and then add a bit of a text. Again, add a subhead and add a number one. Or if you just want to go from like, for example, 15 to one, add 15 and then just move this number inside of this one. Okay, so that's what we need to do. I don't like the color of this because it's not seen well. So you can just always click on the text that you want to edit, click on the color text color. And for this one, maybe red is going to be good. Yes, it's seen. So the next step is we want to add the final answer. So heading once more, it's going to be Italy for this one as well. And I'm going to choose to move this down there. And of course, I'm going to increase the size of the answer because that's going to be like this. Okay, so now we have all set up. Everything is on this canvas, right? But I want this to appear at a certain second in the video. Okay, so what you can do, you can click on the items, for example, on this one. And if you want to click like both items, hold the shift key, click on these, right click on it, click on show time in here. And I want this to be seen like half a second into the video. So you just drag this one and then you just move this one. Okay, so you move it. I'm going to do the same for this one. Now you just click on this one. But for the Italy, I want it to appear later in the video. So I want this like this. Now just move this head, move it to a play head. The answer is going to be at the last seconds. I'm going to do it like this, let's say. Flag is going to be at the beginning as well, half a second into the video. And of course, this is going to be half a second into the video as well. So you can see now how it's going to look like. I'm going to play it for you so you can see everything appears now. And of course, the answer is going to appear somewhere near the end of this video. So people have time to think which country is this one. Now, in order to make this more beautiful, we're just going to add certain effects, certain animations, all right? In order to do that, you can just click on this one and click on the animate here. Now, I want this to fade in. Guess the country is going to fade in. Hint and pizza, I want these to fade in as well. But for the country flag, I want it to pop. Okay, pop is good for country, looks good. And for the final answer, I want to click on it and I'm going to choose burst. Okay, so burst is a nice option for me. So let's have a look how this looks like now. So you see, really good. The final answer is going to burst like that. So Italy. Right away, it's really cool, right? Nothing hard. You just play with like drag and drop. You don't have to code. You don't have to search for something. Everything is inside Canva. So it is worthwhile. Now, in order to make all of these, in order to just not make one video for all these separately, Canva has really good option. First of all, I want you to head over and I want you to search for all of the flags. So read the countries. So for example, I don't know, India, and then just go one by one, search the flags, click India, Indian flag, India flag, here are the photos, do not forget that and choose one of these. Now what I want you to do once you select right click on it, then add to folder and then create new folder by clicking on this button, create new. And then of course, I'm going to name these, for example, country, add to new folder, and then add all of those respective countries to that folder. Right away after that, head over to apps. And then I want you to type in bulk create. Bulk create is a huge option that Canva has. Okay, click on the enter key, bulk create, here it is. And now I want you to enter the data manually. You can upload CSV, you can make that in Excel sheet, but that's a bit trickier. Enter data manually is a way to go. Click on it and then you will get something like this. So these clear table, you don't need this. All you want to do now is to go and copy this from ChatGPT. Paste that into the first column. You don't get it like this. Now you want to click on the add image. So it's going to be the fourth column of yours. Now just put those countries, those flags that you have gathered. So I'm going to click on the plus icon right away. You're going to see your folder down there with a lot of countries. 
I only have India now, so I'm just going to place it in the India's place. Click on that country, and that's going to be India flag, okay? They're all named correctly. You're not going to make a mistake. Once you're done with it, once you have all of the country flags, all you got to do is to click on the done here, and then it's going to make you one for each one of these, okay? You see how simple this is? The only downside is that you have to pay for it. There is a subscription on canva.com, but of course you can use the free trial, which is 30 days long, and that is more than enough to set up your channel and to start getting some money in order just to pay for Canva subscription. And Canva is not so expensive. It's like $12 each month, but you have like these bulk create options, which is really good. And you can play a lot and you can just make a lot of these videos and all that you need now is some hard work from your side and some ideas. With the hard work, you just have to help yourself. You have to be consistent. Nothing is gonna come on its own, but for the ideas, just go and see what these people are doing. You know, you don't have to reinvent the wheel. You don't have to make nothing new. You can just go and see what they're doing and you can just repeat their videos. Of course, in your own way, you have to design them on yourself. But if you lack the ideas, just go and see what they're doing. These channels are pretty successful. So you won't make a mistake. So for example, what do you prefer? Guess the food, choose one button. They really have loads of ideas and we've seen that they just get a lot of money so if you decide to copy these people well you will just be like them okay and of course as you were able to see canva is a really easy tool to use and they have that bulk create option use the free trial and just do it okay if you have some passion for it if you think that this is fun to do trust me it is just go and do it you don't have nothing to lose okay you don't have to pay for canva right away as well so just go and try it out. Take some action and get that money. I believe in you. I'll catch you.